welcome to Adrian McMaster Gaming. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install Gabs at Y maps so that could either be for the subscription based or the standalone. But I think the main ones which people have trouble with are the subscription based. So I'll show you what to do. So first. Go to your browser, make sure I line that up. There. So you go to your browser, type in Gabs5M, and you should see Gabs store most popular maps on your 5M. This will be in the description below, so take a look there for the link. Then you would create your account with Gabs, which I have done. When you've done that, you have two options. A subscription based which you pay monthly for that which is about 16 pound 28 on the british light currency on other currencies that will be different so you pay that monthly and um, then you've got your standalone which is like a one-off payment for each and you've got those for life but they only work with your license keys that's your cfg and i'll show you that in a minute things to remember about the subscription based is if you cancel the payments at any time, so say you've bought like a, a subscription for one month, but it's the third, fourth, or fifth, that subscription carries on till the end of the month, thirtieth or the thirty-first, which depends on how many days it is. So after that date, it stops, and the Y maps will also start working on a subscription standalone. You'll be all right. You've got those for life. So. Let me come off that now. When you've done that, you want to go to your Key Masters account, which is to get your license key. You are allowed up to three license keys. So I've got one for like a development server, a demo server, and the main server. So the demo is the one which I'm showing you now. So that's all you're allowed. It used to be allowed more keys at one time, but to reduce that because of people sharing keys. So that's what you're allowed up to. So you acquire that license key. And to download them from your account, that's when you've paid for whatever it is, a standalone or subscription, you'll see these items have been granted assets. So if I click on that again, you'll see that, there it is. So you see there, CFG Gabs Packages and CFG Gabs Packages 2. Anything else I've got there, which is like, a standalone and ones like me own. I was testing the subscription to see how it works and it's sort of but it has to be done right so it's all linked to your account so if you're not doing a server anymore and you wish to transfer all these packages to another account you can do but be cautious of that be cautious of like scammers out there who might want to join up with you doing a server and ask you have like one account and transfer everything to that one account be careful of that because they can scam you if remember if you if that's going to happen make sure you have access to, to the password and make sure the password has never changed because if it is by the other person you've lost everything there there's nothing 5m will do because it's down to you to transfer uh, if you transfer that's your fault and not theirs so be very cautious of that there will be people out there who will try to do that you know who want to team up with you you know and say oh you know we want to work together and have one account and have all these scripts you know i pay for my scripts you pay for yours and have what have more one account next thing you know the other person but either you both got access one of you will change the password it's you know and then you are stuck you've lost that forever unless of course you've got a good solicitor then yeah you might get somewhere so that's what you do there so use your eyes to keep when you've done that go to your resources create a folder called gabs or gabs y maps which is what i've done i have a folder for the ordinary wire maps. The reason I've got Gabs wire maps is a reason for this, because uh, they are specific ones and they start in a certain order. So that, 
that's how they are. I'll, I'll explain in a minute. Also, when Gab's mind maps, which uh, isn't obvious at first, because nothing on the read me. If you look in the Gab's map data, there it is. There was something I came across which had me uh, confused. Door locks. Now that will work if you're using QB core with QB door locks. Fun, funny enough. Uh, so that will save you doing all the door locks around the wire map. So something else to remember now is you need to do a CFG file called Gab's wire maps. That's so I know it's linked with the Gab's folder itself. So then what you do, go in the Gab's wire maps and in the Gab's folders, the um, zip folders, there will be a readme file. In that readme file you'll have instructions uh, Right, um, things to ensure you follow that. Make sure you copy and paste that into the Gab's wire map CFG. Important to understand this you've got at the bottom there that you cannot use these four resources at the same time, which means one, two, three, and four. So you cannot use the hub, the PDM, the impound, and Benny's at the same time. If you do, you'll get a conflict. The conflict that you'll see is run by, uh, where is it be you now? The near Legion Square on the map, if you know where that is, the main part where people hang out. You've got the ammunition shop, which is just over, over to the right side as you go down to the car dealer. Then just on the left side before the car dealer, there's a Benny's uh, garage there with a shutter door. If you're running all four, you'll get a conflict with another wire map in the way. You've got to run them, if it's standalone, one at, one at a time. Now, you can don't, if you're not going to use the standalones, any of them, don't use. Use the hub, and you'll have the hub, the impound, and Benny's. So it's marked up as they are. You'll see the hub, there it is, read below. Tells you there, reblock, which is what I did. It took me a while to fi you know, figure it after testing, and I, I realized what was what. So that's what you want to do make sure you only run the hub. Also, another problem if you are going to run other Y maps with gabs, you may get a conflict because remember, different developers do things differently with the Y maps. So, for example, I can explain this. Uh, Bobos's police station, which is up at Sandy. I, I have that police station paid for. Now, I tried to use the Sandy Shore Hospital from another developer. Now, it conflicts. The interiors o overlap. You don't see it, they're invisible. But that's what happens. But with Bobos, you've got a Y map and a Y map. You know, there's two. He does the hospital and the Sandy Shore. If you try to use them for other de uh, developers, they will conflict. Also, another thing that happens, which I can see that from the props, um, is when the developers add something like uh, onto the map, you know, where they put props in or remove a prop, that's after they've done the, the main stuff with, uh, I think it's 3DS or something like that it's called. They'll put the props in, or they may remove stuff about move things like trees. But as soon as you move a tree, that adds a folder in of a, of a load of like props. So what happens? Another developer might have removed them, so you're going to get this conflict of like one's trying to add, one's trying to take away, and you're able to get a crash of some kind or things there that shouldn't be. So. It's always wise to be careful, and like it explains on the website, use only gabs if you're going to use gabs. That's why it's there for. Maybe at some point, me and the actual owner of the, uh, of the actual server will have in individual files after having for like a subscription. It's all dependent. We are looking at that. So what you want to do next? Yes, a file called gabs dash y maps. And there it is, CFG. So what you do, like I said, I've created that, is in your main CFG, your server CFG, type in execute or EXECX gabs da dash y maps or gabs web files name dot CFG. So what that does when you run, it'll start up 
every Y map that's listed in the Gabs Y map serves you, apart from the ones that are hashed out. So remember that. So if you're going to have like Gabs CFG CFG file in a folder, for example, you might have a folder called Gabs. Then that CFG in a folder. What you do, if it's called Gabs, you put G A B S forward slash. So then it's looking for that. Also, I'll show you something else which is important. Close this now. Don't need. Go back to the folders. Back to the thing. So also remember, if you can see that Gabs. It's got the brackets. What it does, it'll go resource Gabs Y maps. It looks in there. It'll go oh found folders Gabs. Then it'll go FX manifest ah stream. I can start those up. It'll find that they're listed on the FX manifest. I know you've got uh, Gabs Pack One and Gabs Pack. It'll show it like that, but don't have it like that. You've got to have them all in one folder. So what I'll do, I'll close this down now, and within a quick flash. I'll be in the server, so I'll see you all there within a few seconds. Right, so here I am now with my character in my de demo server, and you can see one of the Gabs Y maps, which is the uh, Pleto Bay uh, police station. I'm going to go in there now. The do yes, the doors are unlocked. If you use the Gabs door, the door locks, they will. They will work, so this is what they look like. Not sure why I'm lagging. This is what you would normally see. It is lagging a bit because I've got the graphics set a bit higher than normal, I think. It needs to be dropped a tiny bit. It's because, so th this is what someone else I will explain in another video. People keep asking me a lot why they're getting lagging videos and everything else when they've got a really good top-end computer so that's what they look like i'll go to another wire map just the uh and there it is. Now these are running on all three license keys that are linked to my account. Well, at least two of the keys. So they're all linked, definitely linked to my account. There's a third key for the main server when that will be up and running. So that's how I test everything out. So that's the emission route. So this is the Bennies you would have a conflict with if you've got your very little standalone ones running. But there's another problem that happens every now and again that cannot be out uh, sometimes you might go have multiple characters in and you'll you'll see one or two of them disappear this is a problem with, with the Gabs Y map you know it's something that can't be helped it's like it's something he is trying to work on which I've read but it doesn't know how to cure it yet so it's just something you have to bear with until it's all sorted out but the Y and you can see there the car dealer in the corner there it is so what you'll have to do for that is you've got to make sure you see there I've got the the cars are set for the actual other car dealer so they will have to be all adjusted and I've shown you how to do that in another video which I did so you just follow those steps to do that quite simple so that'll be it for this video and as always thanks for watching and if you've liked what you've seen, click like. If you want to see more from me, please click subscribe and I'll be back with another video soon. So I'll see you all then.